<laughs> I was out biking and I felt that I felt that I just had to share this um, about belonging. So my entire life, I I had this feeling of being able to connect with everything and nothing. So it was the feeling of belonging everywhere, being home everywhere, but at the same time, being home nowhere. Um, <laughs> so I grow up with the, the, the primary feeling of not belonging anywhere. That no matter where I went, I I was always different, right? You you guys know that feeling. <laughs> um, and the last couple of days, I I have just been feeling into this because to not belong is the feeling of isolation, and the feeling of isolation. Uh, keeps us apart. It makes us shut down in a form where we think we are something and everybody else is different in a form of disconnection and the truth is the only thing we disconnect to will be ourselves. Yeah, but they, they're they different and I come in here and I don't want to be here and you know that feeling? Um, <laughs> it is a guide. It is a guide to help us to find out where we feel that we belong, to find out who we are. So when we put ourselves in situations where we don't have um, the same perspective to life, we can open our perspective to see it from another perspective or we can feel, okay, this is not a part of me in the creation I have within this lifetime. People always tell me, <laughs> and this is, annoys me so much, <laughs> like, oh, Elisa, you're becoming more human. And I get so angry. So I, I wanted to look inside of myself what this means. And the underlying, the underlying feeling of becoming more human is that what I associate with this is to becoming this myself because of the growing up part that every time people... Uh, said being more normal, try to fit in, sit on the chair, <laughs> read the book, you know, it was always like um, a blockage to become something of which I were not. And therefore, I have this reaction of becoming more human. How to feel that we belong instantly? Human, I isolated form, means that we are here in this three-dimensional creation, that we belong, that we are the same. We are in this physical body, which is really awesome, and we are here having this experience. We could not have that if we were not human. We are a species in human form, and this is awesome. No matter where you are, no matter where you go, no matter who you meet, on your path, there will always be something, always be something you guys have in common. Doesn't necessarily mean that you want to eat together <laughs> or that you all like football, but you all are humans in physical form. Either you have in common that um, you wake up every morning, that you become happy when you see the sun is shining or you come happy when you do exercises so the way to instant feel belonging is instead of feeling or instead of having the perspective which focus on all the things you don't have in common then shift your perspective into those little lines where you actually are belonging where you actually have things in common. That will help you to ease into whatever situation you are in, in whatever country you are in, <laughs> whatever setting you are in. I know a lot of people who don't understand 90% of who I am, but they don't have to. <laughs> How should they ever understand who I am if I don't even understand it myself? <laughs> so it's all about allowing yourself to feel one and when you are with people see the beauty in the difference see the beauty in the connections and 
allow yourself to take within that moment um, <laughs> what gifts there are for you to achieve in that moment. When you walk away from there, then allow yourself to feel, okay, if I ask myself, do I really like to be here? Yes or no? What was the beauty of our connection? What did I learn? And what is my next step from here? It's more we allow ourselves to be who we truly feel we are, whatever that means. It's more we start resonating with those people who have the same things, who have the same um, perception of life. And then we can see each other. Then we can have the feeling of belonging. Then we all of a sudden have created family and friends on a deeper level. So focus on finding out who you are, finding out what feels right for you in life, allowing yourself to be freely. So yes, be human, but be your kind of human. So you send out what you are. That allows everybody around you to see you for who you truly are. So those who are resonating with that is capable of seeing you. And that's what I wanted to share with you guys. And I just want to wish you a lovely day. Doodoo.